I'm sure it's on the list of many people that come here from all over the world that they got to see the Hollywood sign. Yeah, it's iconic, the Hollywood sign, but it was vandalized over the weekend by a prankster who managed to change it from Hollywood to this, Hollyweed. Lots of people in Los Angeles took to Twitter on Sunday morning, posting pictures of the sign, including some celebrities too. Snoop Dogg tweeted out this, Hollyweed, that's where I get my mail, he says. And Tommy Chong from the cult classic Cheech and Chong tweeted, what a great way to start the year. Well, the sign has since been restored. It's back to its normal state. California recently voted to legalize recreational marijuana beginning in 2018. We are on the story with CNN media reporter Frank Pallotta. Frank, good to see you. Good to see you. So this sign is massive. If you've seen it up close, you know how big it is. I think like 45 feet. It's pretty impressive that someone was able to bring a tarp up there and make it look real like it says Hollyweed. How'd they do that? Well, what they did was they took some tarps and they kind of went in from behind. Police said that they, between midnight and 2 a.m. on New Year's Eve, vandals went up there, a prankster went up there. They think it's a man. They're not exactly sure. They caught it on security footage. And what it did was actually kind of a brilliant prank. It, 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 from afar, it really does look like Hollywood. I remember I woke up on New Year's Eve morning after a long New Year's party and I go, what has happened to the Hollywood sign? <laughs> And uh, basically, like, it's such a really kind of, I got to say, it's kind of a fun way to start 2017. I saw on Instagram, Miley Cyrus wrote, what a great way to start the year. <laughs> and you know what? I have to kind of agree with her. I'm a prankster myself. I, I, I can't think of a better way to hit up such an iconic landmark. Yes, but we don't recommend it at home. No, don't do it. Don't do it. This, don't do it, but it is funny, you have to admit. So seeing this in the past, it's a tar people want to see the Hollywood sign when they go there. It has been the target of vandalism in the past, and they set up a new security system around it, but apparently, do they not have cameras that can see at night because they can't make out the image of this person? Well, it's a it's a very it's a very kind of condensed area. It's very hard to see up there. It's not like there's a public park or anything. Right. I mean, you can get to the sign, but they keep it very much separated. It's not like the Griffin Observatory where you can like walk right up to it. But the funniest thing about this uh -huh. is this is the second time in the history of the Hollywood sign that they've changed it to Hollyweed. They changed it back <laughs> in 1976. How many? T yeah, exactly. Look right there. How many times are they going to do this? It's it, it's just a kind of like a it's a fun thing, but. Obviously, this is a this is a crime, and most likely, if this guy gets caught, he's gonna do some time. Is it for true it. the guy passed away who did this? So it couldn't be the same guy who did it the second time, right? A at this point, you never know because you look at this Hollyweed. It's a brand new year. It's 2017. Anything can happen. <laughs> Are the police saying anything about this? I mean, let's say they catch the guy. We are laughing about this. Could they face serious charges? I mean, this is vandalism of a very iconic landmark. L.A. takes this sign very, very serious. This would be like the equivalent of if on the Empire State Building, someone changed all the lights to say right. Hollyweed. You know, like this is uh, that wouldn't really make sense because it's the Empire State Building. But I digress. <laughs> we get it. We get we it. We get, get it. it. We get it. <laughs> but this is still an important landmark. And not to mention, they don't want people to do this. They don't want people to go up there. And it's a very dangerous area. It's not like you can just walk up to the sign. So, I mean, if if he gets caught, he's probably going to at least get fined. I mean, it's a crime. It's vandalism. Right, like the Statue of Liberty, something as famous as that. Exactly. All right, Frank Pilata, good to talk to you. Thank you. If Thank they you. catch him, you got to come back on. I will. Appreciate it. Well, the Internet is buzzing about Mariah Carey's New Year's Eve performance. The set started off pretty good on New Year's Rockin' Eve with a...